It's been a minute, guys. We're doing a real vlog today. Yes, a real vlog. We're going to Annapolis, Maryland, the capital of Maryland. And uh, let's enjoy this ride. Just filled up, obviously you can see the gas pump out there. Uh, just filled up my car. And uh, yeah, it's really like a last minute kind of thing. I was gonna go Sunday to DC. I ended up, I have to work on Sunday. So we're gonna do that the following Sunday. So be looking, Creators and Coffee coming up on, I don't even remember, I don't even know what the day that is. Give me one second. The 25th of February, Creators and Coffee in DC. More details to come. Uh, I will be posting it on Instagram, Twitter, everywhere. If you want to check out my social media, check out the links in the description. And I will be posting uh, who, what, where, when. Not why, because why is because creators are, that's why we're. I'm doing this. I just want to bring you guys together uh, and bring, and I will be there hosting it. I won't really be hosting it, but it's just gathering creators, like-minded creators, and just getting more intimate than just a, like a conference kind of scene. So it's like maybe 10 to 15, maybe 20, depending on how many people actually show up. So let's go to Annapolis right now. downtown Annapolis it is very very nice outside so I'm gonna go walk around get some street photos and uh, probably get lunch first because I am absolutely starved but it, is, it feels amazing out here it's like 60 degrees a little bit of wind but that shouldn't matter too much it's just gonna be a great day coming down here taking some photos getting out of Delaware for a little bit so I can uh, experience some more livelihood and almost city-ish kind of place. Annapolis isn't like huge, huge city, but it's close enough, right? The reason I came to Annapolis today was to get out of Delaware. For, for me, I really enjoy places where there's a lot of people, there's things to do, Delaware has neither of those. They have some people and they have some things to do. And somebody's excited. <laughs> but by nine o'clock, everything is closed or at least it's like just dead and there's no nobody around and nobody wants to be out that time. When places like Annapolis and New York and I mean Ocean City in the summer, but like right now it's dead. Uh, but in Delaware, nine o'clock is basically bedtime there. And when you go to places like Annapolis or New York, there are places like open like almost 24 seven. And I enjoy being able to wake up like three in the morning and go out and go do something. It's kind of nice sometimes, especially when you want to get out and just explore and do things. Cause where I live, here look, this is a picture of Gumboro. There's a church a fire hall, a liquor store, that's it. Oh, and my house, and a couple other houses, but that's about it. And then the closest pl like town, Millsboro, it's, it's definitely growing, but there's nowhere like open past 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock is closing times for every single place in the area, and I don't enjoy it at all. to Delaware and it's not too bad of a drive it's only like an hour and a half two hours uh, to get to the gym can get some pre-workout soon and uh, well I want to talk to you guys one little thing and I say all these negative things about Delaware but there are a few positives but they're not like positives to me so like traffic sometimes is great because there's barely any uh, because there's a lot less foot traffic there's no foot traffic barely at all, but there's all automobile, car traffic. Um, that's all I really can say. It's flat, not really many hills, which is a good and bad if, depending on where you're going. Uh, if you like to hike, obviously you want more mountain that's not flat. 
but yeah, that's all I, the only good things I can really say about Delaware. All right, so I'm gonna go head home now. It's gonna be a little long drive, but uh, I have a little something for you guys when I get back. So I'll see you guys then. <laughs> Alright everybody, I am back in Delaware, about to go right into the gym, but the one last thing I just want to say about Delaware is I cannot relate to the culture per se, to especially the country kind of culture. I'm not a fan of country music. I do like the food though, not gonna lie, corn fritters are amazing, so is Scrapple. If you don't know what Scrapple is or have never tried Scrapple, please try it. Don't worry about what's in it yet. Look what it's in it after, just eat it, it's amazing. So that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along t with me to Annapolis and uh, just talking about why I'm ready to get out of Delaware and why I really don't like it. So I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy. Go out and go create. It's Andrew Howard, A. Howard A. Peace. <laughs>